Hello, I am William from Plipplop Land, and today I would like to share with you my typing game, which is available right now on Plipplop Land, the home page. Let's jump straight in. This is rather unique amongst the Plipplop Land library because, of course, it deals with typing. Uh, students do need a little typing practice. I often have them write up speeches and stuff in a, a Jamboard or a slide or something like that to get them a little typing practice, but they still need a little more. And this is a pretty good option, I think. So um, the first step is the topic selection as with most of my activities. So I'll just choose something very simple like bugs. Again, you can choose a specific list or you can choose entire topics or you can mix topics as you want. So I will choose those few and begin the game. Now here we are. There are three game modes. There's free mode, there is timed and there is trial. So let's take a look at free mode. I'll start it up. After a brief countdown, the game will begin. Yeah, so there's butterfly. So as I start typing, the letters change color, as you can see, FL. And then as I hit the last one, I get a point and it moves on to the next one. It's pretty simple. There you go. Grass. S hopper. I'm going to mess it up now. But good. And so as you can see, in free mode, the list repeats. It repeats endlessly and there is no timer. That is the basic description of uh, free mode. You can do as many as you want. So you can tell the students, here's your topic list. Uh, keep going until you get 20 points and then call me, something like that. Anyway, I'll quit out. Uh, the next thing I'll do is I will change to timed mode. Um, so there is a timer setting below, which can be 30 seconds, one minute, two minutes, or three minutes. Uh, I'll leave it on 30 seconds for now. And start. So in timed mode, the timer is going to count down. Uh, so it's butterfly and ant. Hold on a second, I'll go through the list once and the grasshopper and as you can see now the list is repeating so again the list repeats uh, not infinitely but it keeps repeating until the time runs out so I'll keep going butterfly grasshopper and spider keep going and grasshopper again butterfly again and time over now now I got to the end time over and it's it's over. So the principle behind the timed game is the timer ticks down and the words list repeats until the timer is is expired. And now I got 14 points. Pretty good. And the last mode is the trial mode. And trial mode is a little more interesting. I'll change to trial. I'll change to one minute. So in trial mode, I'll start it up. The timer starts counting down, as you can see. 60 is counting down. But as I type in the letters, when I hit T, maybe you'll just see if I time it right when it gets to 50. Wait for it, 50, Aye. the time goes up. Uh, you get a second back every time you finish a word, um, butterfly. You get a point and you get a second back. However, I'll type in there, grass, hop, E. When you get a letter wrong, so now I'm supposed to hit R, instead I'm gonna hit uh, E. As I get a, hit a letter that's wrong, you can see the timer dropping away. Every time you get a letter wrong, you lose a second. So you get one second back every time you finish a, a word, and you lose a second every time you make a mistake. But, as you see here, the words list doesn't repeat. You only have to go through the word list once and get to the end. When you get to the end then, any excess time is added to your score. So I got four points for the four words plus ten for the ten seconds. So my score is fourteen. And that's what trial mode is all about. So, uh, students certainly enjoy this one. They certainly enjoy this one. The most um, exciting way um most exciting variation version the most exciting mode game mode i have found is the timed mode where they have one minute to try and get it as many times as they can a uh, trial mode is pretty good as well but um some students are struggle with typing pretty significantly uh, so you, you want to be aware of them maybe some students are as with other picture quizzes and stuff like that, they are finished and other activity very quickly and you want to find them something to occupy them while we're waiting for other students to catch up. This is a really good um, application for that. Uh, and then if they might be pretty high level, you can get them doing the trial. You can get them doing it in 30 seconds and give them a great big long list of, of words. Some of them are really complicated. Not complicated, I don't want to say they're they are difficult words like buildings. Choose all the buildings, for example, and put them in and then trial and start and then all of these words are going to start appearing. So what have we got there? Bus space stops as space there as well. There's no other punctuation, I don't think. Mentary school. I think I removed all of the apostrophes and uh, I'll take you on street. There you go. City hall. So on. Well, you get the idea. So there you go. Uh, that is the typing game. 
available right now and play around is pretty good one i think it's a different challenge to some of the others anyway that's all i have for you today i hope this game is useful for you and if it's not or if it is i would still love to hear about it in the comments below or on twitter and if this game doesn't help you out i hope there is another one on flip land that will but that's all for me today and i would talk to you again soon goodbye